If you're having problems synchronizing your Digibyte wallet app on, the, on your iPhone and, and your coins are stuck in it, don't worry. Here's the solution. You can install the Digibyte Core wallet, which when it's open, it functions as a node. And so you have it open, right? You, and you have it all while working. Then you figure out what your IP address is, but not your external IP address. So your internal IP address. So you click on the thing where it says the connection and click on up at network and sharing center and then where it says uh, Wi-Fi connections click on it and then I click on details and here you have your local IP address 192.168.0 that is your IP address, right? And now you're gonna put that in here. Go here, settings, and all the way down where it says advanced settings, Digibyte notes, switch to manual mode, enter this number. In here so for example for this one is one nine two that one six eight that zero that three and the port number is going to be you see where is that where is this ghost of that 12 zero 24 I'm just gonna type in here 12 zero 24 And then it says currently primary node and it's connected here. If it doesn't say it's because your your app is your Digibyte app on your computer is not uh, is not is behind before the your 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 phone's uh, Digibyte uh, history. So once this gets all the updates and it gets up to date, then it will start to synchronize. Then if not, turn this off and turn it back on. And then that's how you get your, your app to synchronize, get all the updates, and then you'll be able to use your coins uh, by having it connected to here as I tried and it worked. If you go outside or you use your phone's uh, Wi-Fi, wi then it will not be connected to your computer, of course, through your network. And then you won't have access to your Digibyte uh, <coughs> updates and stuff. So you, you'll do it on your at your home. Unless you open on your, on your router on your internet connection you open the connection and then you figure out what your IP address is external IP address is and then that's what you will put on your phone and you when you go outside you know what I'm saying so <laughs> that's kind of a pain but that's you know an easy way for you to move your coins out of a wallet that may not work but as long as it, this works you know it's great because 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 it's secure uh, so that solves this problem thank you and take care and uh, goodbye and after it has worked and you finish uh, synchronizing then you can you know go to your your court wallet click on a receipt click on request payment have an image come out 
with your address and here is where you will be sending your coins meaning not the image I'm showing you that's my wallet if you want to donate then go ahead but I'm saying uh, the image that will be showing you on your computer on your wallet will be the one to receive and then you can send a small amount to make sure that everything is smooth and then send the rest once you uh, are done however I have to tell you there is a risk uh, and then you gotta click on on help or settings or somewhere here find out on the on the web how to get how to back up your desktop wallet because if it gets corrupted then you will probably lose your keys and lose your coins so you gotta save that right uh, thanks for watching take care